right, apparently Floyd and uh Geronte Davis is back uh bumping heads again. Um after uh you know it, it was revealed that Floyd Mayweather didn't show up to a Mexican press conference to promote his fight either with Victor Ortiz or John Gotti the third, and they paid allegedly paid him a million dollars. And Floyd did the French. How many of us have them? One love, one love. You only have people like what? What is all of that? He pulled a fucking Houdini for those who don't know. Shout out to Houdini. I think they was the second rap act to go platinum. First was Run DMC. So, if you're in the hip hop trivia, because most of y'all don't know rap, like y'all think Drake won the Kendrick Lamar uh, battle, like a uh, angry man ass. You know what I'm saying? I'm looking like dude. Niggas in the South should is y'all shouldn't be allowed to speak about rap, real rap. Y'all should talk about 2000 on back when y'all start uh, snapping and popping and and uh, you know Soldier Boy in front, back, side to side and shit. When y'all start doing that shit, anything at, before that. You know, anything before like the mid 2000s, I really think people from the South should not speak on rap. Y'all could tell them I said it too. I fuck with his channel, but um, yeah, yeah, them Southern niggas, man, they, they shouldn't speak on nothing until niggas was wearing tall T with stickers on it. Cause they don't know shit about rap. Sorry. But shout out to Outcast, my favorite duo though. But hey, they, them niggas now South, they don't know shit about rap. Niggas barely know how to pronounce words and words and shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Sean. Yeah, Sean. I know his wife from New York City. She know more about him, more than rap about him. Yeah, Sean. Dead ass kid. <laughs> Shout out to Kobe. Yes, yeah, son. Kobe don't speak like he from Jamaica, man. Or he don't speak like he from New York. Nigga speak like he from like uh he speak like he from uh Delaware or some shit, New Haven, <laughs> Vermont. <laughs> Clam chowder shorty ass nigga. Yeah, I'm, I'm roasting his ass. He said, uh, but Floyd Mayweather probably didn't show up to a press conference in Mexico. This nigga can't even write, read, or screenshot the right way. Oh, Lord. To the press conference in Mexico, officially announced his fight, his next fight yesterday. The CDMX government, I'm guessing that that's the Mexican government, are said to be very disappointed as he allegedly being paid $1 million to appear at the event. This nigga getting millions to appear at the event and then, you know, don't show up. You know, and then he allegedly could, you know, be having some money problems. And like I said before, you know, like I said, four hundred billion dollars ain't no real money. You know what I'm saying? Check this out. Uh Jeff Bezos. Um, he got more money combined than every NFL owner. Think about that for a minute. Jeff Bezos got more money than every NFL owner combined. That's why they won't let his ass in. So at the end of the day, I just feel like, you know, that's 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 what that's what that's what Floyd want to do. Floyd can do it. But you got to pay that million back. That's that's the problem. When you start doing bad business deals like that, then people ain't going to give you nothing to show up in, you know, nothing. And it's only going to be so long that he going to be able to box and do this shit. Trust me. It's only going to be so long before he be able to box and do this shit. You know, and I told you, I nigga that got to go out here and do a, a, a pony show. You know what I'm saying? That nigga broke. You don't see motherfuckers retire and then go back to doing what they was doing. And, and they got enough money to comfortably retire. Absolutely not. Or they got other residual income that's coming in or passive income in where they can live comfortably. No, nah, you boxers are dumb. These promoters is, is robbing them of money and, and rights and ownership and throwing them on the street and doing it to the next fighter. So they was going around talking about, oh, top rank racist and they doing this, man. We ain't seen shit to your own people do it to you. Everybody think, yeah, black people should stick together. No, 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 no. You niggas stay right where you at. <laughs> you niggas stay right where you at. You niggas and black males stay right where you at. Cause they do you worse than 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 the other. Real spill. But you know, tank uh caption, he out here scamming again, taking people money. I mean, there you go. He he just got out of a situation. You would think he'd be trying to show up and everything, but maybe he ain't have enough money to put in his jet. 
Maybe he ain't want niggas seeing him on spirit. <laughs> oh, shit. Floyd on spirit and shit. Oh, man. I thought you make smart investments, nigga. You on spirit. <laughs> you on spirit, nigga. <laughs> Do the spear fingers for spear fingers, spear Floyd. <laughs> Do the spear fingers for spear Floyd. This nigga on spirit. <laughs> Come on, man. This nigga Floyd on spirit. <laughs> Could you imagine? Could you imagine? Shit crazy. Could you imagine Floyd on spirit, dog? To break the internet. Floyd in town on the same flight as shit. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> That nigga Tom Love Spirit. I'm good. I'm Gucci. I am Gucci. Y'all got it. But, uh, okay, and Floyd clap back. Hold on. We gonna clap back. We gonna clap back. We gonna clap back. Let's take it to war. So, this is sad. Hopefully, this isn't, it's just a rumor. So, he's saying the fight. Floyd says, Tank Davis and Frank Ballpark Frank is canceled. Javante said, this ninja is such a hater. He said some shit canceled. That's not true. Ninja, this is my shit now. Keep talking. I'll pull up to your house now. I'll lay hands on you and some other ish. Oh, see, man, ain't going to do shit. Man. Every time he get around Floyd, he put his head down. Tell me I'm wrong. Tell, tell me I'm lying. Every time he get around Floyd, he put his head down. He put his head down. Every time. Every time he get around Floyd, he put that head down. Pause. <laughs> Pause. Every time he get around Floyd, hey, he put his head right in the dirt. Right in the dirt. So they just doing this to sell a fight. Two fights that nobody care about. That's just what it boiled down to. Two fights that no nobody care about. You know what I'm saying? Two fights that don't nobody care about. So that is what it is. I mean, this is funny. Because they can fight in the exhibition and that shit, that'll get Floyd out of debt. He can make four, five, six hundred million fighting Javante Davis. You know what I'm saying? But they get in the same room, tank, tank gonna get humbled. He talking about it's my shit now, like it's really your shit now. I mean, TPBC about to go up under. What they say? Don't hate me because I'm close to the edge. I'm trying not to lose my head. <laughs> under under tank leadership, PBC, them niggas gonna be at all them niggas gonna be at uh all them niggas gonna be at the unemployment office. <laughs> They say, I don't know where to be found. We ain't never know where to be found. That ain't nothing new. I ain't never met him, but, you know, we talk on the phone every now and again. The money good. Better be if when he was over there, too. He said, I never met the guy. He said, I never met the guy. I knew the money was good, though. Wow. I've heard great folk stories about you, Al Heyman. <laughs> But man, they just two good kids trying to sell a fight. Two good kids trying to sell a fight. That's all that shit is. Ain't nobody, ain't nobody care about that ballpark Frank fight, bro. At all. Nigga, ballpark Frank was just fighting in motherfucking uh, clubs and shit. <laughs> they playing knuck if you buck and hoes twerking outside the ring and shit. This nigga was literally fighting in a club. $20 to get in. 40 if you want to get in with that five. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on. Come on, I don't bite me. Oh, it's almost sold out. They gave them tickets away. They gave them to the graduating Las Vegas Henderson High School class of 2024. To the whole school district and shit. Got tank, got tank tickets. The whole school district got tank tickets. Oh, 
Whole school district got tank tickets. If you buy if you buy one in and out burger, <laughs> you got a tank Davis ticket. <laughs> Real spill. They may well then nobody going to see you fight Victor Ortiz, John Gotti at the same time. It's over with. So you might as well get prepared to fight Javante Davis or Earl Spence in a real fight. It's over with, boy. It's over. But hey, let me know what you girls and guys think. Thumbs up the video. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel. And the subscribe button. Hit the bell icon button. Hit all notifications. Increase the chance to get notifications. We go live and drop video financially. I'm going to support the channel, Cash Up, Dollar Sun, CJ Good 313, Venmo, CJ Good 313, PayPal link in description. Hit the link tree, find me on X, Instagram, Spotify, Anchor, Cash Up, Venmo, PayPal, um, Apple Podcasts. Uh, check out the Patreon. Check out the Box News playlist. Peace.